Hey y'all, it's Shannon. Okay, I got a big lot haul for y'all. It's not too bad of a haul. So let's get into this. Do y'all shop at Big Lots? Let me know. I'll let you know how much it is at the end of the video. So let's see what we got. Okay. So my grandson has been pointing out the veggie chip or sticks. So this here is Eat Smart Snacks and it's veggie crisps that I got. <clears throat> It has eight <clears throat> snack packs in it, sea salt. Uh, it's gluten-free, non-GMO, 100 calories. So let's see. This is in back. Four grams of fat, 16 gram, no, I'm sorry, 15 grams of carbs, one gram of fiber, no sugars, and one gram of protein. I only say those because that's what I go by because of testing my blood sugar all the time. So I got two of these and where'd it go? And they were three forty nine. dollars All right. On to the next. Okay. <clears throat> now I've been eating um, yogurt. I do, I, I had it for breakfast this morning and I did like three fourths cup of yogurt. Um, and then I did a quarter cup of granola and a quarter cup blueberry. So what the granola that I'm using, which this is the, the granola that I've been using is the right value brand. But of course, you know, big lots, you find different things. So this here is Aaron Baker's, um, homestyle granola with ancient grains, fruit and nuts right here. So it's the crumbly granola like that. Um, let's see. It's non-GMO. It says woman, women owned. Okay. Um, okay. So uh, for a fourth of a cup, and that's what I use in my um, in my yogurt, uh, is 130 calories. The fat is six grams. The carbs are 19. Fiber three. Sugars, and that includes um, the hidden sugars 11, and protein three. So, yes, it's kind of high, but, you know, it just helps with, you know, with that. And this here was $4.99 for the family size. So, what we got. Okay. I've heard a lot of people talk about ghee. G-H-E-E, -E, ghee. And this is Himalayan pink salt, grass-fed, pasture-raised. <sighs> Fuel happy. Oh, let's see what it has. Okay. Um, 13 servings per container. One tablespoon. 120 calories. Total fat, 13. Uh, sodium, 96. And that is about it that it has on here. And this is six ounces. And it was $4.99. So, do you guys use this? Let me know. I'm trying to do a lot more healthier things, and this was on one of those lists. So let me know. What do you guys use it with? Because I'm fixing to do my research and see. Because, um, yeah, okay. It's very new to me. Okay. This was a last-minute thing, and I was going to get it. it. I got them to munch on them on the way home because my daughter was driving. But that being said, um... I didn't because I needed to really test my blood sugar. So I didn't do it. I was a good girl. And this is platinum roasted and salted whole cashews. And it is 13 ounces, keto and vegan friendly. These were $4.99. Cashews are a good nut for me to use, uh, to eat. So is Brazil nuts. And I only eat maybe a palm full of my palm. Um, 13 servings in this. Serving size is one ounce. <clears throat> Calories 180. Fat 14. Carbs 9. Fiber 1. Sugars 1. And protein 5. So I, I do kind of like, you know, keep that stuff on here. Try to at least. Okay. 
Believe it or not, the main thing that I went into Big Lots for was cereal. Because Jerry, my husband, has been eating a bowl of cereal at night. I don't know. He gets he goes through this thing where he can't sleep, so he'll eat a bowl of cereal. So that's what I mainly went in there for. So you see, you know, yeah, I have a lot more stuff. Okay, this here is the Kellogg Special K Red Berries, um, crunchy wheat and rice flakes with red strawberries. There's two bags in here for four ninety nine. And let me see, one cup is, and this is not with milk, and of course they use skim milk. I want that. Um, 140 calories, and this is dry. Uh, fat, half a gram. Carbs, 34. Dietary fiber, three. Included added sugars is 11 grams in protein, three. But yes, these are actually really good. I do like them, but I'm gonna be a good girl. Okay. Oh, okay. The doggies. I got them genuine Serrano half ham bones for dogs 20 pounds and up. These were $4.99 a piece, and there's actually two in each one. So I probably should have got another one because we've got three dogs. Didn't think that went through very well, but I'll go back and get some more. Okay. The bags are so cheap. They rip and rip, and everybody's complaining. Just go back to paper bags, y'all. Please, paper bags. Paper bags. Some more granola. Um, both of them are Aaron, Aaron Baker's Homestyle Granola with Ancient Grains. This is fruit and nut. Also, it's a littler one for $3.49. I just went ahead and kept it. And then the other one is family size, and this one is vanilla almond. Corno, I guess. So, okay. I got this, and I got a couple of other ones, different ones. These are for a tasting Tuesday with my grandsons and I. Yeah, I'm kind of scared of this, but hey, it's going to do it. Warhead Sour Green Apple Soda. Yeah, that's going to be fun with the kiddos. $1.29 for this one little can, so... Alright, I'm getting there. I bought two of these uh, La Castena refried pinto beans and they were, how much were you? I think they were $1.79 if I'm not mistaken. Okay. And then I got General Toes, Toes Stir Fry Sauce. These, this was a dollar ninety nine when I make an Oriental dish, stir fry or some sort, and I got another one. And this one here is Korean barbecue, and it was a dollar ninety nine also. So I love to do those and um, have all the vegetables and, and and all that good stuff in it. The only thing that I don't that I don't have and I need to get it is my water chestnuts and the baby corn. Okay, and then I got some Garibaldi. Premium baking semi sweet chocolate chips, three forty nine. Because I do need them for baking. Okay. Okay. Here, the other ones. Okay, this one is a, a Warhead sour lemon soda. Those are gonna be fun. Then I got a Jelly Belly juicy pear. Like the jelly beans, y'all, I finally found them. Now, these were $1.99, kind of pricey, but hey, I can't wait to try them. And then I got another one, Jelly Belly Very Cherry. And then this one here is Jelly Belly Watermelon. I can't wait to try these. Okay, calories zero. Fat zero, carb. Carbohydrates, zero. Sugars, zero. Wow, everything's zero on this. What is this one? Everything's zero on this one, too. So these are going to be like a sparkling water. Oh, it is a sparkling water. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to try those. 
Okay, what do we got? Okay, I got these for my grandsons. They were $4.99. Uh, the Legos you built, uh, Speed Champion. I got two of those little cars you built. I got them just because, just because I love them. Okay, then I got this. Dr. Teal's, okay, it's for kids. Gentle Epsom salt, elderberry and vitamin C with essential oils, boost and renew. Um, I do like to sit and soak with Epsom salt for my old bones. So I got this and it was $2.99, y'all. $2.99. Okay. I think I'm almost done. Yay. Okay. I got this huge thing of granulated gar garlic. And it is by Fresh Finds. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, this was $4.99 for this big old thing. So I figure I could get four small ones or I could get that one for the price. Then I got some whole wheat. Garnier shampoo and conditioner, and it is coconut water and aloe vera. And I just really like the smell of it when I popped the lid and took a swift, took a swig of it, took a sniffy swig. Okay, back to cereal again. Oh my gosh. Okay, I got some Frosted Flakes. This is the giant size. And $3.99 for the giant size of this. And then I got some Raisin Bran, $3.99 also for the giant size. And I know these guys are not the best of cereals in the world, but they're better than the Fruit Loops and all that other stuff. And then the last but not least, I got this for all of us, really. I just think it's so much fun, you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm a sucker. And I got this, an electric ice shaver to mix snow cones. We're gonna make one tonight for the kids. I can't wait. And then I got this to go with it. So it gives us three flavors and the little cone things. Ah! This was $14.99. And this was, where? $31.99. So I cannot wait to do this with my grandsons. Okay, let me find amongst all of the trash here. Okay, so for the grand total, y'all, I spent $157.44. Ah! But um, I should think I got, I think I did okay. Maybe, maybe not. Still expensive. But, anyways. All right, y'all. Let me know. Do you guys shop at Big Lots? Do you like Big Lots? I get there every few months, couple of months or so. I don't go very often. But, yeah, I, I did like my finds this time. So, let me know in the comments. Do you guys have a Big Lots near you? What do you guys got? Do you guys got the same thing? Have you tried any of this stuff? Let me know. I want to know. Until the next video, y'all take care. God bless and peace. Bye.